Quick Tips is brought to you by Domain.com. Little is more annoying than reflections when filming, showing your lights, crew, and you. So today we are looking into a few ways to minimize that frustrating issue. Some reflections are easy enough to handle. Just change your angle or on something like a car window, you can just throw on a circular polarizer filter like we showed in a previous episode. But something like a pair of sunglasses can be all kinds of difficult. First option, of course, is just change the angle of your actor's face. Turn their face away or tilt it down until you get rid of that offending reflection. The main problem with this approach is that you're now limiting your actor's movements, which is almost always a bad thing. So one quick trick that you can do is buy yourself some anti-glare spray, which you could get from any hobby store and most hardware stores. This one is called Frosted Glass Finish. I'll take the sunglasses and put one small coat on the lens and you can now see how it works. Basically just blurs everything out since it's frosting that lens. On the one side, we have all sorts of issues with reflections and on the other, we're good to go. So we finish this by spraying the other lens and we're good. Of course, this changes the look of the sunglasses. You aren't getting any of those solid reflections anymore and maybe that's what you want to be able to see that other character in the reflection. And if that's the case, then altering your angle really is your best bet. With that same sunglass issue, we had this shot here in an older project we did. Originally, you can see my whole crew and all the gear and the reflections of our glasses. It was super bright on that day and we were moving fast with me in front of the camera instead of behind it. So when I got into editing, I found all these reflections. To solve this issue, I brought the shot into After Effects, created an adjustment layer, masked around just the lenses of the glasses and added a blur. Then I just had to keyframe to follow the glasses and I had pretty much the same end result as the spray. Of course, I wish I would have just done the spray ahead of time and saved myself the headache in post, but if you ever find yourself in this issue after the fact, there you go. But there you go, two very simple ways to cut reflections out of your shot. As always, a big thank you to the people that make this show possible, Domain.com, because no domain extension is going to help tell your story like a .com or .net domain name. Domain.com is reliable, affordable, and easy to use. Save 15% off your comms and nets at Domain.com with the coupon code QUICKTIPS. Because when you think domain names, think Domain.com. And as always, until next time, write, shoot, edit, repeat.